Hey guys, my dog's name is Benji One here. Today we'll be doing an unboxing of these pit bike plastics. And there should be a kill switch in it. <clears throat> it is from a pit bike. I'll show you how to attach these to your pit bike. But yeah, let's get into it. This is a bit different, this uh, opening, pack opening. <laughs> Not pack opening. But, uh, this package opening. As for the fact that um, that this time it's nothing to do with gaming or anything like that and I'm using my GoPro so yeah uh, let's get into this is it already open? I don't think it is so that's it for that and that's it I think so mudguard uh, number attachment plate thing sides other sides back plate or back mud guard and then two panels for the back where the exhaust is so yeah so uh, let's go and show you how to attach these to the bike right first what you need to do is peel off all the wrapping to your pit bike plastics. After taking off the plastics, uh, arrange them in the order that you're going to put them on. In. So, for example, that's obviously the front of the mudguard, uh, sticker plate, uh, side panel, side panel, side panel, side panel, and then uh, back. Next, unscrew each panel on your pit bike but make sure make sure that you keep the screws in a safe place you may notice if you've got a CRF 50 style pit bike plastics at the front one there on one there now Got to take those off. You know what? It's not just attached at the fuel tank there. And for me, there's two at the back. But I've just taken those off. Okay. Now this thing, this should just come off like so. Quick tip, if you're needing to, whilst this is off, you can clean any bits of mud that there is there on the suspension, if you need to. Right, so this is where it comes in handy to lay out your stuff. Because now you know that those two are going to go there. That's pretty obvious, but for me I just find it easier. And yeah, uh, I realise that I haven't got the mud guard off yet, but I'll show you how to do that. Um, once we've clipped everything on place on this one. Okay, good stuff. Like on the last one, uh, it's good to just keep your bolts and stuff in a safe place because there should be several screws under, underneath the seat. One, two, three. That one doesn't have one. Four, five, six. Now I've just got to take those off and they should all just clip off. As you can see, uh, at the front, they've already come off because there's only uh, one there, one there, and one there, and there. So there's nothing attached. Um, these just clip off like that. So with these ones, like that, come off. And at the back, flip it over. Should. If you, sorry. If you just pop. Backwards like that. It should. There you go. It should come off. Take it out of there. Right, these, the side panels. Where is it? There we go. 
they should slide this way there we go like that and then push them that way and there we go and then push it push them I think it's that way it's that way and they should just come out dropped out like that the back one it's just been a little okay it's come off there we go that is now free from all them plastics let's get the new ones on right so they're the old plastics these ones here that I've just taken off fitted the brand new ones looking really good and yeah let's put it on the bike if it's a good fit hopefully it will be It'll be a bit annoyed if it isn't I'll just pull that back a bit I think we're on we are Bring it up at the front either side good right we're on now I've just got to tighten these up and then after that I'll show you how to do the front mud garden uh, uh, and this thing I don't know what I call that sticker plate I'll call it a sticker plate oh yeah right guys now that we've got the new plastics on and everything um, we're just gonna and now as I promised put the front on as you can see under there there's a bolt and there so we've got to take those out to first get what's left of this old mud guard off and to get the sticker plate off as well so let's do this Guys, now we got what was left of the mudguard off. <laughs> Clearly nothing. Um, we're just gonna go now and get this sticker plate off. Sticker plate is really easy to get off. It's just it's just connected at the top here. And you just pull it out like so. Just come straight off, and then we now just pull this out. There you go. Sorted. Right guys, it's in there now, it's just laying on the surface, right now we just need this, and I'll just put it in, there we go, that's in now, that's not coming out anymore, so we're good, we're good, is that definitely in, yeah that's definitely in, right, now, that's on the front there, we can put it under here, and it can attach to there. Right guys, after a little bit of fidgeting, I managed to just get this on. Because it was new plastic, it wouldn't like bend in properly. But luckily now, well not luckily, but now it's in. And we can start tightening it up. Thank you. 